It's been almost two years since Milwaukee County passed an ordinance to advance racial equity and improve health. So has there been progress on either front? Gabrielle May is live in Milwaukee tonight following today's State of the County address. Gabby, what did we learn? Yeah, well, basically Crowley says that this is a work in progress and it's going to take time. By now, we are all familiar with the dramatic disparities highlighted by the pandemic. Whether it was the early data showing disproportionate cases and deaths or the difficulty people of color initially had accessing, accessing vaccines nationwide. In his State of the County Address, County Executive David Crowley shares what's being done to give people of color better access to health care. When we think about our service alignment team, they're bridging the gap on health disparities to determine what, where, and how services are delivered to advance equity. And those team members also inform decisions on where to make investments that tackle the root causes of health disparities. Nearly two years ago, Milwaukee County passed an ordinance to advance racial equity and improve health outcomes. Crowley says the measure of success is still a question mark. We are already in the process of figuring out different types of dashboards and data-driven approaches that we want to take, but also how do we make that data public-facing as well uh, so there's a level of accountability from the community and our external partners. The county ordinance also set a number of goals like a more diverse and inclusive workforce. You think about the amount of women and people of color we now have uh, in, in leadership positions. Those are some of the things that we are seeing changing. Crowley says there's also been an increase in people of color in management positions within the county. We're also taking an internal look as far as what we need to do um, it, within Milwaukee County as an organization. Now, Crowley also made it clear that the county still has a long way to go. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Gabrielle Mays, Fox 6 News. Gabrielle, thank you.